Hey folks, it's Mark with the Varsity Dad channel. Today I got three items that I'd like to at least introduce to you for those Rivian owners. The first one is this nifty cell phone holder right here, and it's a magnet. And because I'm filming with the iPhone, I can't really put it there, but it just comes here and I don't really charge it because the second item, but I do like having it here if I need to use uh, a different map software or have some other app running while driving. The second item here that I'd like to show you is this right here. This is a charging, uh, a wireless charging mat, and it has the MagSafe uh, magnets here for charging two phones. And this is from T-Wraps. And I really like this because the wood here matches the OEM wood and it looks really good, but also has a great functional value because it fits perfect and it just plugs into the OEM USB-C ports. But if you look here, this is how the stock charging mat is. It's very slippery and it barely works. Uh, for R1 owners out there, you know what I'm talking about. So this is a perfect fit and it charges well. It's got a little slot for my Apple wallet. And the last one I'd like to show you, uh, well, there's, I guess, four maybe. There's a little organizer here that I like to use. But below that is my Electron supercharging adapter, okay? So this is the Electron. And many of us R1 owners are waiting for the official adapter. Uh, I don't know when I'm gonna get mine. So in the meantime, this is what I've been using. I used it a couple of times already and there was probably half the time it didn't work. But I think it's because some of the Tesla supercharging stations are not compatible with adapters. And I think this is an issue either with the Rivian uh, mapping system that needs to let us know which ones are compatible. And I don't, I didn't feel like in a long trip that I made that it was as accurate. So. I don't know, maybe that's something that uh, just requires more use of different apps like PlugShare, but it does work where the superchargers are compatible. I don't need a lot of battery right now, but I do intend to try charging it and to show you how it works. Okay, so if you come to the charging port, the instructions are we installed the adapter first. So you got that good click. Then I'm gonna take just pop it in there. All right, so take a look, see if the charging goes as it's supposed to. It's starting. Let's see some more details. It's charging at uh, 90 kilowatts going up in the past I've seen it go up to two to low 200s so there it is electron adapter for Tesla superchargers so this is a I think a dining kind of attachment I think that's the name but uh, it's got a Rivian logo on it it's got a couple of cup holders it just comes off pretty easy with double-sided tape if you wanted to make it a little more permanent and the cup holders also come out if you wanted to use it as different storage really like it it's very functional and custom fit thanks again for tuning in hope you like the review of the rivian accessories must-haves if you like the video and you like the content of our channel please hit subscribe and like and we'll see you soon thanks